What's up guys, Sophia here with another affordable drugstore, very beginner friendly makeup tutorial. And I'm gonna be showing you how to get a smoky eye. Um, it's super simple y'all, I promise y'all. If you wanna know how to get this look, then stay tuned. All right, so I already have my foundation on and I'm just gonna put some concealer on my eyeballs and underneath my eyebrows. All right, so I'm gonna be working mostly with two Maybelline palettes, Shayla, and I'm gonna take a few, like a color from there and then the Chill Brunch Neutral, probably. And so I'm gonna use this color for the transition shade because I know that this color is kind of dark, but I'm gonna try to like light handedly put it on there because you don't wanna. All right, once you kind of have that on, you're gonna get a black from the same palette, this black right here. And it's important for you to have some type of base because for me, when I put on black, it's like a lot of fallout. Like, I don't know how to explain it. It doesn't kind of go on my eye right. We'll try to put something underneath so that it has something to stick to. So notice the black is all under here and this might even be too high but when you open your eyes you don't want the black to be up there because it'll start to look like you have a raccoon eye if you do too much thing i'm going to do is go back in with that other color that i had with the blending brush i should just go in and lightly touch the top of the eye just to kind of like blend out the harsh lines and you i dipped it back in the um the transition color and you just want to be careful because the black can like spread all over your eye and you don't want to look like a raccoon. So then I'm going to go with this one, this dark purple color in um, the Chill Brunch Neutral, I think that's what it's called, the Chill Brunch Neutral Palette. You're going to get a smaller blending brush just because you're going to concentrate this on the outer V, go here. Okay, so this is pretty much the base of your smoky eye. Obviously, we're gonna do things to give it more of like a umph. So also in the Chill Brunch Neutral, I'm gonna get this color to do, to kind of go underneath the brow. I mean, I want it to shine but then I also want it to kind of blend into this situation that I have going on on my crease. Okay, and so if you notice that you can't really see the liquid liner because it's black, but if you look at like, cause I don't have liquid liner on this side and I do on this side and it's still gonna dry if you give it a second. But if you just kind of look, this eye looks a lot blacker and darker than this one. And so that just adds to the smoky effect. I got some fallout underneath my eyes already. Oops. But I'm gonna get this black liner and like focus on that part um, just to, Make it look a little smokier, I guess. And so we're going to get some mascara. I don't put on false eyelashes. Um, so we're going to layer this just so that it looks thicker. And so like put on one coat, wait till it dries, and then put on additional coats. And then I'm gonna wait till it dries a bit and then I'm going to um, put on an additional coat. While that's happening, we can move on to other things. And I'm gonna put a highlight. I'm just gonna add some concealer. This is, lip, this is cream here. And then I'm gonna, put, I'm gonna put highlight over it just cause I want it to be really like 
and I'm gonna use the Wet n Wild Blossom Glow to give me the glow that I want. And as you can see, just putting the powder underneath can just really bring out your highlight. Um, so yeah, and don't worry if it looks discolored, we are going to get that momentarily. All right, now to thicken up the eyelashes, I'm gonna put in a second coat. So now that we got the highlight on, the last thing we're gonna do is like blend all this because it kind of looks crazy. Um, but I want to put the contour in first. I want to put the contour on first and then the blush. And then you could do the finishing touches to make sure like everything in your face is like doing what it's supposed to do. So I'm going to use a cream contour cream and just going in here. Um, I'm going to get the NYX blush in the color rouge. And I always get the blush and just put it like I didn't blend in the contour yet because I kind of blend the blush into the contour. I just feel like it gives it a better effect. Okay, now my makeup look is pretty much done. The only thing I'm sure you can see is like under my eyes, you can tell where the stuff clashes. And so I'm gonna get my foundation brush and just fix that up to make sure it's not looking all crazy. And then for the lip color, I'm going to use Pixie Beauty Berry Boost. I should have put on the liner first, but I wasn't sure if I was going to use it, but I think I am. I'm just going to get the same black eyeliner and just kind of put it underneath my lips. Okay, so that is about it. As you can tell, it's pretty smoky. You can always get a darker black if you want to. Um, but it's enough smoke for me, so it was super beginner friendly, super easy. I told you, right? Okay, so if you are loving this look, if you like my video, if you like me, then give me a thumbs up or give me a follow or not. <laughs> but um, yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys another day, another time. Bye, y'all.